Hi there, my beloved friends. This is your servant Virendra Diyar with reverence, with respect and a great motive to serve with a license on success and inspiration and motivation so that tomorrow your future is brighter than what it is today. Showing you the path, enlightening so that you can climb new steps of success and become great in your life. That is the basic motive of mine. And you are a very persevering, persisting, born great with the power of the mind to control and direct and become a person of your dream with your great determination, daring, energy, enthusiasm. Once you have set a definite purpose in life with a burning desire and you have also a well-organized planning with a lot of dedication, determination, you are persisting and persevering. And in spite of all your sincere effort, you are not crowned with success and you are getting disappointed, you are getting discouraged and fear and doubt start creeping in you and you become so much disgusted, frustrated that you feel that it is better to quit and escape from such kind of turbulent, turbulent, uncongenial circumstances. There is the words I want to tell you. Never quit, never give up. You are passing through the test of your patience, the test of your perseverance, the test of your determination, daring, perceiving the real truth that you will be one day what you will to be. As you have dreamed lofty dreams and you have desired very strongly and intensely, you are going to be crowned with success without any doubt, without any confusion, without any kind of uncertainty. So in that situations when everything seems going wrong and it looks that the night has become perennial and you don't see any hope of any future, then I remind you what was once told by the great wealthy philosopher Corsus to the Persian king Cyrus. I am reminded, O king, and take this lesson to heart that there is a will on which the affairs of man revolve and its mechanism is such that it never allow anybody to be always in the same circumstances. It prevents anybody from occupying the same prestigious, glorifying, happy and cheerful situations. Mean to say, the fortune turns like a wheel. The fortune turns always like a wheel. If there is night today, there is sure to be day tomorrow. Your darkness will not be always permanent. Your suffering, sorrows, grief and all the adverse situations will not be maintaining its status quo. If you have hope, if you have promises, if you have visions, if you have ideals and which are based on noble thoughts, right thought, backed by your willpower, your determination, you are bound to be coming flying colors. 98% of the people become failure because at the first glance of impediments, adversity, misfortune, they just surrender, they quit, they escape. And if you have also trying to do now, I just encourage you, never do that. Never, never, never quit because success is failure, turn inside out. The silver tint in the cloud of doubt, you can never tell how close you are. You may be very near when it seems so far, so stick to your fight when you are hardest hit. It is when things seem so tough, 
that you must not quit. That is the basic philosophy of success. You have to go all sorts of temporary defeats, adversities, misfortune, but you have to keep on keeping on, persevering, persisting, daring and driving, always believing, always having the capacity for applied faith that your dreams are going to be reality, your thoughts are going to be things in due course of time. But what you need, just hang on, persist. And in that case, I like to recite a very inspiring poem which can really encourage you and always inspire you to hold on to your faith, to hold on to your purpose, to hold on to your dream. And here I go, just listen very carefully and always try to practice in your life. Say not the struggle not availeth. Say not the struggle not availeth. The labor and the wounds are vain. The enemy faints not, nor faileth. And as things have been, they remain. If hopes were dupes, fears may be liars. It may be in you a smoke can sail. Your comrades chase, even now the flyers. And but for you, possess the field. For while the tide waves vainly breaking, Seem here no painful inch to gain, Far back through creeks and inlets making, Comes silent flooding in the main. And not why stern windows only, When daylight comes, comes in the light, In front the sun climbs slowly, How slowly, but westward lo, The land is bright. Yes, smile, dear friends, wherever you are, under what conditions and circumstances you may be living, know it. In the ocean of life, the happy isles of blessedness are smiling. Keep your hand firmly on the helm of your thought, the definite purpose of your life, the sunny shore of your ideals, promises and visions waits your coming. In the bark of your soul reclines the commanding master. He does but sleep, wake him. And if you have a disciplined mind, dedicated, complete effort, a calm demeanor, a poise, powerful personality and fixed purpose, on right thought, you are bound to come flying color. Never yield. You are an equal heart of heroic character. Very strong in will and determination. You must strive, you must seek and find and never yield. You are great. Believe in yourself. You are born to be great and you are Sure to be great, no doubt about it. This is your friend, Virendra Diyar, always loving you and always caring for you and always sharing with you all the blessings of the great poets, thinkers and philosophers which they have given us in the form of their knowledge just to motivate you and inspire you to realize your another self which is sleeping wake him you will be what you will to be dare to dream strive to achieve and never yield thank you very much wish you all the great success in your life thank you